Yo, I had to hit Steam up for the re when I got this one. I literally ain't had this game but for one freaking day. And within that one freaking day, I probably played that game for like a total of about 30 minutes. And I was like, nope, ain't doing it. Can't do it. It's been a long time coming. We put in years worth of work. And now we getting recognition. People keep asking what it's worth. We tell them it's worth more than gold. Worth more than dough. Worth more than anything when you coming up. Yo, what's good, people? It's Second Royal TV here, and today I wanted to make a video on a review slash um, first impression on a game called Lifeless. And before I go any further, I just want to say I hated the game. Uh, it probably does have a bright future ahead of it, but the way they straight out the gates. I guess they tried to, like, tried to, like, go to, like, straight push, like, throw the first punch in a boxing match and whatnot, and they trip and fell over their shoelaces, because this game had so many bugs, so, so much stuff, like, it's so much stuff that was wrong with this game that I don't even think, like, I think that they should have known before they even published this game or put it out there that, yeah, we got a lot of stuff that's wrong with this game. Let's go over this. Like, for starters, when you get in the game, and this is just my pet peeve, but when you get when I run the game, when I start the game up, it goes in the window mode, and you have to click the little tab to expand the window. So that was my first problem. My second problem was after I created a character and I go into the server list and I found a server, um i like sit there for like 30 seconds, probably 20 seconds loading in. And then it'll say, welcome to, uh, what was it? Water Bay something? It's something. It's like basically saying you're joining the game. And then it kick you right back to the main menu. So you have to start all the way back over. Well, not start over on your character, but you have to start all the way over, like clicking on a server and then waiting. And this time it takes longer. And then once you finally get in, you have the most unoptimized game yet. Like, I could see if some of the stuff was optimized, but nigga, you can run in the middle of nowhere and have eight frames per second. I ran into a town. I ran from the wilderness, which I had only two um, FPS and below, probably even less, probably 12 at the most and dropped to eight. But in the wilderness, I had like eight frames. Once I got to town, I had like 12 to 16 frames. And this is with everything on low. Because when I had it on high, it seemed to not even make a difference wh whichever, whatever it was on. So I, out of the gate, just hated the game. The mechanics is weird. Like um, melee weapons. I tried to melee a zombie and it was right in front of my face. I didn't hit it not once. So that wasn't, that was, I was like, yeah, that needs a lot of work. I hated that. I really feel like they shouldn't have dropped this game as early as they did because I understand early access alpha, but there's just some things that I feel like the devs should like fix before they drop the game and say, hey, play this game, check it out. Because that'll ruin some people's like thoughts on the game. That'll ruin your reputation. Like it was so much stuff that was wrong with the game that I think that even they knew about like I'm pretty sure like as you can see the reviews are mixed like there's only one difference right now bef um, from it being like even but I've had like they said most people got i7 um, processors I have an i5 processor with the AMD graphics card with it which is an R9 380 and a R7 370 and these people have better uh, graphics cards and everything than me and even with them having it on low settings they're getting about the same frames if not worse than mine so that was that was a fail that'll make that's like saying play this game even though we haven't optimized it or anything so I was like nah I got my refund within like that tw within 24 hours I got my refund which you can see is pending right here 
which I refunded it yesterday. And I actually just decided to play the game off the fact I've been watching YouTubers play it and they've been saying how good it is and whatnot. But nigga, I don't see what's good in it. Like, if you ain't got no gun, then this game ain't good because you can't melee nobody without dying because the mechanics is broken. And speaking of guns, I was shot I was shot um yesterday by a guy with a shotgun point blank. And I barely the shotgun sound wasn't even that loud, so it was weird. I was like, bro, this that's not that's not a good sound for the shotgun. <laughs> sound is horrible it's not even that good so that's an L what is it's an L um when you try to exit out of the game the game freezes on your screen so you have to alt tab out of it and then you have to control alt delete and get it out in the task and task manager <laughs> I think I'm about to ask for a refund from this game. This game is trash. Can't. I have never played a game so bad. Bro, this game is so bad. Why did they even let that? So, in my opinion, this game shouldn't have even been um, the price it was, which the original price is $19.99, but it's on sale until June 23rd, and it's $17.99 because it's 10% off. I feel like this game should have been ten dollars or less because like this game this game make me feel like they just trolled me to like one in this game and the youtuber that I watched get it actually got a free copy of it so he probably ain't as mad about it as I am because nigga I had to spend hard on hard earned money for some trash game that ain't even well optimized and it's making me just upset that I can't even play this game especially when um, the game takes about an hour and a half or an hour or so to download. Nigga, that's an hour out of my day I just lost because of your trash game. But um, they might have, they might have a bright future ahead of them. I don't know. At this point, I really don't care. I told a friend um, cause he's caring about the game, and this nigga told me like. He gonna keep the game instead of refunding it because he see a bright future and stuff. But he also said that about the previous game he influenced me to get. But but then the game played it in like three weeks or probably two months, I forget. But yeah, he had he believes in the game but hasn't been playing it. But we gonna see about this because I told him once they op optimize it and fix them broken mechanics, um, holler at me and I'll probably buy it again. I mean, I don't care about losing $19 about this sale because that's just $17 I just saved for a rainy day because these niggas, that, that ain't even a good look. How you going to, I don't understand how they even put this game out there and thought that it was going to be that big of a success. Like, for real. That, that's, that's a mockery. That's, that's retarded. But yeah. Um, my thoughts on the game, do not get it yet. I say wait at least, um, what is it, June, June, July, August. I say mid-August, try it out, see how far it's come and whatnot. But as of now, don't even look at, don't even look this way. Don't even, don't trust no type of YouTuber. Like, like they might say it's good and they say it's all right. They say the, it looks good and stuff. I don't know if it's because I play on a TV, the reason things might look different, but I feel like 
Um, from my point of view, this game didn't even have that good of graphics. Like, it was alright, but it wasn't that good, especially since I tried to run the game on low settings because the game I thought was going to run better if I put everything on low because usually medium gets me 60 frames per second and up. But, yeah, man, um, get in the comment box. Let me know how y'all feel about it. And, uh, like I said, if you, like, if you play the game, then let me know how you feel about it. If you interested in it, let me know how you feel about it, whatnot. But like I said, this game is boo-boo. And I honestly will not be looking back at this game for about a month or so. A month and a half at least. And like I hate to give a bad review on it. I hate to say mean things about it. I don't know any of the people that make this game i don't know how many people made the game or how many people are on it but still man like even even the devs should have had a chance to look back at this and test it out before they drop it and just say oh this is a few mistakes let's at least fix this mistake no them niggas threw them niggas threw crayons in front of a child and said do your worst and this is what we came up with. But, yeah, man. Um, that's my thoughts on this first impression. This is only my opinion. If you think the game if you think the game has a bright future ahead of it, that's you. That's your opinion. My opinion still stands. We both have opinions. I feel like the game might. It's a slim Jesus chance, but they might. I don't know. Like, we got so many survival games out now that I'm trying to see what's going to be different about this one other than running around on like 15 FPS like I'm in DayZ in DayZ before the 6.0 patch. I mean the .60 patch. I mean seriously, that's that's exactly what I thought of when I was playing this. I was like, is this the unoptimized DayZ? And yeah, I got that refund up. I don't know, so 17 bucks saved, my nigga. But, yeah. Later, guys.